I'm Ron Plath and I'm a member of the United States Blind Golf Association and today we're at Stone Creek Golf Club in uh, the beautiful Mount Hood territory of Oregon. This is Steve Malicote, friend for many many years who's coached me on the USBGA tour so to speak in my first national championship and this is Jim Nicola who maybe one day will be coaching me if everybody gets tired of, of following me around. You got through all your friends. After I've lost all of my friends, maybe one of you guys will be the new coach. <laughs> At least I found one I can make right here. No, that wasn't a double hit. You notice how many breaks I get with this group. <laughs> and we're teammates. Just an outstanding athlete, a tremendous guy, and he, he just, uh, you know, has it all. He pays off, off the uh, distance. He walks it off, he walks back, and he's got magic feet. He can kind of actually feel the tilt of the grass. Get you to tend? Yes. It feels like it goes left. In, in the, the world of blind golf, there's the, the three sight divisions. Mine is the most vision, which we, we have what they refer to as 10% of uh, useful vision. I get around fine, but I'm after about six to ten feet things get really blurry and then if that's a b3 a b2 blind golfer would be a little worse than that and then the b1 golfers are totally blind i've been approached by the board of the united states blind golf association about maybe holding our national championship back in oregon and naturally the first course i thought of was stone creek we did have the championship here in 2006 and everybody loved it people that work here are really nice and, and one of the best things is it's a dry course. Even during the winter when it's raining here in Portland, this is one of the driest courses around, so it's a lot of fun to play. When I was diagnosed, at first you know you don't believe that this is going to happen, and then later I've accepted, okay, we're the first thing I couldn't drive, and then I go to, well, I can't read, but I figured I was always going to play golf because of the passion, and from being a member of the USBGA, it's, it's, I've seen people with much worse vision than I have just enjoying the game you know, on a daily basis, and that's, that's countries around the world, men and women. It doesn't, doesn't stop you from doing what you love. It, it does make it a little bit different, but it doesn't stop you. See new places, meet new friends, and make your own memories in Oregon's Mount Hood territory. Check out our other videos and start planning your visit today.